Dirk, ja. du darfst sagen, was du möchtest. Ich darf sagen, ja. Also einmal blondieren. Ja. Dann. Kurz heiß mit den Nacken. Den Nacken in den Kopf. rasieren, die Seiten rasieren und äh, danach Farbe rein. Ja. Dirk wants uh, short hairstyle, so the back and the, the sides will be short, clipper short, 3 mm. And then he wants to bleach his hair and then uh, color in the long hair. Dirk, möchtest du dich mal drehen für die Welt? Ja, das macht man noch. Schön, klack der Schuhe. Danke. Ja, gut schön. Hello friends, in YouTube, come to Dirk's hair again. Now Dirk wants a short hairstyle, want, he loves red colors, and then fire red. So we have to bleach it because uh, there's not much color in, and especially the dark spots stay not that red as he loves it. Start with protection. And we talked about the comment you give all on YouTube. You have to shame yourself because humans are humans and you have to be what you like to be. And he is like a butterfly, you don't see him that often on the streets, but be grateful that the people who dare to be what they want to be. So you first watch in your own mirror and then give comment. Like the wetting the hair, parting. Now, of course, I know when I'm going to bleach the hair on top. I don't need to because that's also red enough, but I will certainly make that in a conditional base and not light it up till it's platinum blonde. We only need a color like an orange color to get a wonderful red color and to support the red color because orange is a better color to get a red on than platinum blonde. On the dry ends, I put a conditioner. Dann schon ein bisschen ab. Um, die Länge hinten, um, beziehungsweise eine, alles was uh, ja, ein bisschen übersteht. Ja, ja, aber das sind so viele, da ist so viel Länge, dass du gar nichts mitmachen kannst. Das ist zu lange. So, ich, nur ich finde, ich nur finde eine das Seite lang, eine, ja, 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 ja. Die andere Seite ist lang. Ja. Und die andere um, kannst du so rasieren, um, wo die Ansätze auch alles sind. Mm -hmm. Ja, ich mache jetzt auf die, äh, was du jetzt hast, mm -hmm. das gebrauche ich, weil ich brauche auch die Stutzung der Haare an die Seite. Ja. Talk about hairstyle and what we are going to do. Now, you see, I get a little bit lower with a short line and that I do because he needs the power of the hairs uh, on the side to support his longer hair. Tip the longer hair aside. Start on the sides. Using a large, flat, thin comb. Now he wants 3 millimeters on the shortest parts. Put my blade to the back to clean the contour line. Connect to the facial lines. Make a nice line to the back. You can put it in a coin position. Travel over the center line using its natural lines 
Let's see it on the scroll gone. In the sharpest position, a clean contour line. And don't force on the skin because he wants it to be bleached. So when I force on the skin, I get irritation and the skin is always a bit sensitive for uh, bleaching. But if you want bright colors, we need sometimes to bleach there. Clean first with a small clip on the sides. And when you see this video, I am in I am in, in America by then. So in Orlando I will be. Set a photo of uh, the place where I am into the video and on the end of the video so you know where you can find me. And I love to go to the States because I, I wanted it for a long time and I wonder what I find of it. But I'll certainly tell you in honesty what I think about the States and the people. Turn the around to get to the other side. Create a strong line on the back, leaving the longer hair a bit on it because I need it to support the upper hair. Put the blade to the back again. Make sure all the lengths are the same. Clean the facial line again. Just by doing putting the blade on the common position. Do the same behind the ears. In the sharpest position I clean the contour line. With my small clipper, I set out the contour line in the sharpest way. Both clippers are from Kione. So now I have a nice clean line to work on. First clean up the hairs and then go to the upper hair. Free the hair. Show you the lines. Now Derek loves to have uh, hair and expression on the hair. So he needs the, the longer hair on the sides. So it's not as long as the upper hair but to support his hairstyle. So I take off only the ends of this line. So with the lightest scissor I have, I create a new strong line. Just be aware you don't go into the hair and into the short lines. Lay some new hair on it. Again go in and shape the hairs around the line of cutting. So also this lines have a line and also a natural line. So this I do by shaping with the scissor. Take out the clip. Now you see this is the longer part, so first go over the center and lay it on the short side, just to see what sticks out. 
You see there's not much hair sticking out, just a little bit. It's better to connect both lines to each other, because that makes the hairstyle also stronger. And you can wear this differently. Now here I have a bit over length. But now I go also in the line of the asymmetrical line on the other side. So see the hair lay. Start at the front and then go to the back and take off the dry ends, not more and less than that. Now you see the line, lay the hairs in a natural fold over the rounding of his skull. You can also see the length here and I want to go till I get this length. I find myself the line or stay in and just gently go to the front. Must be aware of Jesus, otherwise I cut into the cross. I'm gonna take all the hairs from the center over the center. And now I do it with get it in with my fingers, go in. connecting the line. Coming on top, lift the hairs up, stay working in the same angle as I did, and only on the center line I take away the dry ends. This will certainly make the hairstyle also stronger. Now for so far cutting, so now I make him a bleach and then in the meantime I do his uh, Lebensgefährtin. I don't know how to call that in English, but the person he lives with. And we have also many Dutch friends, but now the young people from Germany, they speak all kinds of good English. Especially the people from the university. They can speak very well. How beautiful it looks. That's again Schön, strak ist. Lay the longer hair aside. Start on the lines with uh, applying the bleach. The bleach is uh, 20 volume weight conditioner and weight uh, black system. And this I apply on his hair. Stay away from the orange colors. They don't need to get into the bleach because they support the red. Very nice, so I leave them out. Only take the dark color, his natural color. And so do all his hair. Stay away from the orange colors. They will be wonderful when they are red again. Part every time till I've done all the hair. Then I close it up, control it every 50 minutes. And after that we color his hair nice red. Now I have all the bleach on his hair, left out the longer parts. Put a carton wig around him. This protects his skin from burning effects. Because where the plastic foil is, it always burns a bit more. Close this up, then what I told you in 50 minutes I check it out and when it's light enough I will rinse it out and I show you how I put on the other color. So don't go away, we'll be back. Hello Helke. Hello. 
Da bist du wieder. Da bin ich wieder. Und wo möchtest du jetzt? Ähm, ich hätte gerne die Seiten und hinten kurz anrasiert. Ja. Und ähm, das hier vorne, so, ähm, das ist praktisch so äh, asymmetrisch, ja. so ein bisschen, aber nicht kurz, ruhig etwas länger lassen ja, ja, ja. und dann äh, so ein bisschen asymmetrisch, dass ich das so, wie es praktisch ist, äh, ja. machen kann. Bleiben kann. Und dann äh, Farbe so blau-türkis. Okay. Helga wants a blue color, a turquoise, bluish color. I don't know if I have a turquoise, but I find something like that. We have toners like that. So we have to bleach the hair on top a bit. She wants the side shift, uh, short hairstyle, and she wants to stay in an asymmetrical line. Helga, will you turn for them to show your hair now? Madre. Okay. <laughs> Dankeschön. Hello friends in YouTube. Gonna do her hair. Let's start of course with protection. As I always do. And the cape is blue. And maybe I love you. <laughs> There are many colors in her hair. So for a blue color it would be uh, difficult to remain in the hair because there is also a red color in the grease but they all have longer hair on top starting the underline of the asymmetrical line Start on the sides Start high up Go to the short part on the front Clean this line up Clean my facial line first, so you can see the line that I'm working on. This I do by putting the blade to the back, not on the sharpest position. With my lights come, I go to the parting line. And the nice thing of a line like this is that If you have a clipper, you can do this also yourself, of course. You need somebody who helps you with it, but it's not a problem because the difference between the long hair and the short hair is that much that you can part it always. And hair always grows back. It's also a nice thing of hair. But not for me. I'm bald. Coming into the line of cutting. I love to work with a comb to get a real soft connection to both lines, don't like hard lines. Even in this hairstyle I don't like hard lines. I think it looks better when you see the professionality of the person who did it. Show you this also from the side. Let's dance. Go to the longer part. Work till I get on the rounding of her beautiful skull. She has a beautiful shape. The natural color in the underline stay the same, so we don't have to bleach that. Put my blade in the corner position and the underlines. I put it in the sharpest position. Can also come with the sharpest position, then I have two millimeters. It's not much, but it's more than when you lay it flat on the skin. Lift the hair straight up with my clump, so leaning against the hair fall. Go to The skull bone. Put it in corner position again, and then I can work till I get on the line of the skull bone. 
This wedge has the natural fall of the hair go in the opposite lines. It's very important to watch what the hair fall does because it always travels in different directions, never straight down. Put the blade to the back again. Come with the blade. Throw it out to the other side. Of course, do on this side the same. Rotate the really cap on the roundings of our skull. Put my blade in the sharpest position. Clean the contour line. Wet it again. Start on the asymmetrical side, the longest side in our hair. As she wants to stay in length, so I take off only the dead, what's the need of cutting the dry ends. Back. I lay the hair in a rounding, so in the same circle as the shapes are. You can hear the hair is good while I'm cutting, because you can hear the snipping of the blades. And then you know I have strong hair while I work on, otherwise you wouldn't hear anything. Neighbor Westley is working. Lay the other hair on this. Watch through the hairs what the baseline is of our hairstyle. Go in. Then again, go on the rounding of the skull. Lay all the hairs in the same round, and I'll show you that. So I lay the hairs into the rounding. So I copy the natural fold. Then I go in. Now she can wear as two sides because this also on this side I have long hair. But I have to take care of both sides. And I love the diversity of this hairstyle. You can see there's diversity in it. So now I go to this side, see how it lays. Start on the back, hold it in the angle of the fall of the hair. Come it again. Get in the running. So now I only have to do some hair cutting on top. Go to the center line, lift the hairs up. centimeter or two of the dry ends. In her case I have to bleach the underlines of her hair. Stay away from the sides, don't 
want Tim to be released, otherwise she looks bold. So now I can make her bleach. And the corrections to the line. Before I'm going to bleach the upper hair, I glue the hair on the short sides with a gel and then put a plastic foil on it so I'm certain that it don't come on her natural colors. Otherwise it's very hard to work with it. And put it on the line of parting. Just on the red hair. Take about a centimeter here. Lift it to the other side. And I left the green out. The green doesn't need bleach. So do all our hair. So I have all the hair covered with bleach. This hair covered also up. Make sure there's no bleach on the hairs. So I leave this a bit free. There I take a small part of my carter wig. It's the only side where the bleach can reach the hairs. So this I make sure it's not happening. And then I close my plastic for wait till she gets into the blonde colors. She wants blue color so it has to be blonde otherwise it doesn't fit. So don't go away, we'll be back. Put some protection on the hairs on the sides. We decided uh, that it will be not a red color, but a uh, passion pink. The hair looks wonderful, it feels wonderful, it didn't put anything in it, just rinse it out. Now I kept it dry because the colors uh, we're going to use need to be on dry hair. They give uh, a very flamey color. And Derek loves to have a stunning color, so that's what he's going to get. I need to protect the under hairs for the collar, so I put a gel on, and this to put a plastic foil on it. You can also shape a bit with the product. Make sure there's enough gel on the hairs on the back. I can make a wonderful shape in it, so it will be looking totally different. Glue it on the line, so from under, place it on the line of gel. Now I can start applying the color. And you see it's a very strong pink color. Also with a lot of red in it. This I lay down, lay it on plastic foil, every time about a centimeter, into the conditioner collar. 
I used also the Plex Step 2. So I'm certain that Dirk's hair get a wonderful boost of the color together with the Plex system. So then afterwards it will glow like hell and burn like fire. Lay some carton wicks on his hair. So I don't need to cover this up, I leave this the way it is. But just this is that the color stays on the place where I want it to be. This takes 50 minutes and then we rinse it out. So don't go away, we'll be back. Okay. I put a new plastic foil on her hair to protect the underhairs, of course, for the color I'm going to put on. The color I'm going to use is uh, of Keune and it's trend color. And we make a mix with uh, a greenish color and a blue. This I apply on the hair. Lay the hairs, of course, on the plastic foil. Make sure all the hair has product. And the wonderful thing of the product, uh, when I put, put a photo of it into the video uh, that gets on the hair, is that it nurses the hair also very nice. Now the, all the color is on the hair, so I leave this in for 50 minutes and then we're back. Hello, we're back. This is Derek's new color. I'm going to blow dry his hair. Use the foam with a conditioner in it. Let's do the hair, Derek. Um, the length is also from here. Yeah. Also, so in the direction of the head. Okay. <coughs> Dirk how he wants his hair, so he wants this part down. So make him this hair start. Start blow drying at the longer side, lay the hair side, take a medium light brush. So far, blur. Some attitude. I use the Dirty Angel. Apply it in the under hair. Coming against. That's why I use the Dirty Angel. It makes the hairstyle strong. You can do crazy stuff with it. Set it out like uh, you want to. Would be something for the punk scene. And you don't damage the hair when you come against. Work it out with some nails. And with a hairspray, I secure the hair so it stays the way it is. And this is Dirk's new hairstyle, new color. And thank you for watching. Till next time. Wunderbar, danke schön. Bitte. Super.
Gibt es da eine Medaillone wieder? Ja, sehr gut. Ja. Dankeschön. Ja, ich glaube, ich habe. Ja. Dirk, will you turn around? Möchtest du mal drehen, dass sie alles sehen, wie deine Haare bekommen sind? Dirk has now an edgy hairstyle. Thank you for modeling for me. See you next time. Hello, we're back from coloring. Now we have nice pastel blues, strong. Using a phone. This hairstyle you can wear in different styles. You can also take, for example, take an angle and just lay one corner into the longer lines and then jump off to the other side. I'll show you that in a minute. So you get two different hairstyles. She loves to have the hairs on this side, so we'll make all the hairs on this side. But you see, when I made the cut, I made also some differences in it. So this is the longer part. It lays over to the other side because we need some power in, in, in the front. But it can be possible to wear it just like a bob, as symmetrical bob. Start blow in the other lines. and work my way up. So far, blood dry. Minor corrections to the line. Take a little dirty angel in the underlines. Lay that aside. Create some volume on top. This will work out with a large comb. Fixate the hairs with a bit of hairspray. Lots of shades of colors in it. Thank you for being my model. Thank you for watching. Yeah, danke schön. Bitte. Super. Cool. Du darfst dich nochmal drehen. Tells for you to show you how the hair looks. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Come on. I would like to have the sides and the back a little bit rasiert. Yeah. And this here vorne, so, um, this is practically so uh, asymmetric. Yeah. So a little bit. But not kurz, ruhig etwas länger lassen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then uh, so a little bit asymmetric, that I can so, wie it's practically is. Uh, yeah. Kann. Bleiben kann. And then uh, Farbe so blau turquoise. Okay. Helga wants a uh, blue color, a turquoise, bluish color. I don't know if I have uh, turquoise, but I'll find something like that. We have uh, toners like that. So we have to bleach the hair on top a bit. She wants the side shaved, uh, short hairstyle, and she wants to stay in an asymmetrical line. Helga, will you turn for them to show your hair now? Okay. Thank <laughs> you. Turn around. Möchtest du mal drehen, dass sie alles sehen, wie deine Haare bekommen sind? 
Dirk has now an edgy hairstyle. Thank you for modeling for me. See you next time.